Hello everybody, I hope you're having a wonderful day and today I would like to share with you guys the experience of opening a block of cocaine. Uh, no, seriously, uh, this is a package from Devo Knives. I'm sure you know exactly what's in here and if you don't, we'll get into it in just a sec. The unpackaging knife is going to be the QSP Puffin. This thing has, uh, it's been kind of all over the place, but enjoyable for the most part. The review on this coming uh, hopefully soon, probably soon, I don't know. Uh, I'm working six days a week now. I, uh, I asked the Heavenly Father one day, I want to be able to just work and work and work because I just, uh, I need to work. I need to stay busy. And well, full lo and behold, I got a job that, uh, yeah, I literally, my day is just completely consumed by work now. I get paid well, which is cool, but, uh, yeah, I don't really have much time to do stuff anymore, so I guess that kind of sucks. Alrighty. giant ass blue package. I really like this blue. That's a very beautiful blue. Right, let's get into this. This is the Buzz and I got the reverse Tux colorway. Of course, of course I did. This is a little coaster. Cool, cool. I'm going to pound some drinks right after this to hopefully forget about my day and then in a couple hours wake up and go back to work. <sighs> Nice, beautiful pouch. Cool, tri-colored Devo knives patch. I have a little uh, knife roll, my Olight knife roll. This will go on there immediately. Sticker. This is a cool sticker. This is gonna go on my sticker table right over here. Also my drink mixing table now. <laughs> and a nice big cloth. Cool, cool. It says Devo knives. Uh, the mash, uh, no. Is it the mash? No, no, not the mash. Um, the stout version one stout um, it came all very similarly to this very high quality packaging for sure I definitely enjoy that it's all in the, in the experience oh man I've been waiting for a minute for this freaking thing some more candy hardware pivot clip I'm pretty sure this is a blank pivot in case you don't really care for the uh the logo on the pivot and yeah this is it now i was a little confused when i uh when i got my email confirmation it said two items were coming from wait a minute oh yeah no i, I think i'm actually missing something uh So that's the knife, and then, I, yeah, I could have sworn I ordered something, a uh, Zerkutai Backspacer, not on there. Is it, no, not in there, not in the pouch, is it, uh-oh, no bueno, it's not in there, ah, no big deal, I will... Uh, get a hold of Kev from Lefty EDC. Oh my god. I will get a hold of him and uh, just let him know what happened. Um, he's a super chill guy. I'm sure he'll be able to send one right away. This is nice. Ooh, this has some good weight to it. Oh, yeah. I, I didn't think that this was uh, that I was going to really enjoy the the top flipper but that is actually quite nice and this is a a much more manageable size than I thought it was going to be I thought it was going to be this massive honking thing that um, you know I would play with more than actually use but you know what I uh, this is going to work tomorrow this is going to work with me tomorrow this is nice I really like that beautiful hollow grind let's take a look at that finish on the blade Nice, nice and consistent. No marks. The edge looks wonderfully consistent. I like that. Diva logo on the pivot. Uh, for whatever reason, it almost looks uh, just a hair crooked, but.
but eh, whatever. I, I don't. It's probably not crooked. Uh, there is. Yes, there are some very large pockets of milling for weight relief. Jeez, this thing would be an absolute brick if it didn't have any internal milling. Uh, ceramic ball bearing, ceramic detent ball. Yeah, this thing is wow. This thing is really freaking nice. Uh, I, again, I'm so happy that this isn't some ginormous freaking beast of a knife. It's actually uh, quite manageable. Uh, a nice little wire pocket clip. I know some people at this price point it was like three something i can't remember because it's been a long time does it even say on the little sticker invoice thing no it doesn't it doesn't even say um but wow yeah this thing is pretty darn sweet you know what? i have some paper right here that you could shred up okay some standard printer paper oh yeah oh yeah That is good. That is very, very good. I love that. We got some cardboard here real quick. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy to have this now. Uh, again, I'm, I'm not even mad about not getting the, the backspacer. It's this the other pre-order item included i'm sure there it's possibly on its way on a separate package or uh it was just missed oh crap it's right here god i am such an idiot no it was in the it was in the sleeve it was in the actual sleeve of, of where the box came out of wow okay whatever no big deal kev i'm sorry Sorry, uh, for potentially bugging. Whoa. <laughs> That's nice. That is really nice. Um, this adds no, uh, you know, actual utilitarian value or upper hand. This is just pure knife enthusiast jewelry piece. Um, yeah, this is... <laughs> <laughs> wow, that is really nice. And you know what? Um, the actual visible portion is quite vibrant. There's a lot of detail to that. I wouldn't say that's a super, super high polish, but it's still pretty polished. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's cool looking. That really is. All right, that's definitely going to pop some being on that back right there. And I just, I got to anodize this thing. It's going to be anodized. Not sure what exactly, but, um, wow. Yeah, so that's it. Let's get, uh, you know, before we go, why not do the weight on this real quick? I know all the hardware on here is, yes, all of it is T8, which is wonderful, wonderful. Oh, yeah, like I said, this thing has some weight to it, but it it could be could it could have been a lot heavier. Four point two, honestly, not a brick. It looks like one, but it's not a brick, and it's also not a brick of cocaine. So, you know, that's that's a good thing. I'd rather uh, have you know make an honest living and not sell drugs for money. So, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing. Of course, this is not a review. This is just. Uh, show and tell I'm showing you guys a, a pretty cool knife that i pre-ordered um again it was rather pricey but um devo knives has sezzle i believe so you can make payments and in increments and at least for me in my financial situation i got the well the increments were something that i could definitely stomach at the time so and it's it, it was paid off within the first like i don't know like two months or something like that um, but yeah, I've been waiting for this thing for a good second and I'm so happy to have it in uh, as perfect as it's gonna get for the condition. I mean, it's it's solid side to side, nothing up and down. It's a rock. Zero, zero movement there. Uh, detent lash, nothing non-existent. This thing is uh, it's going to be an absolute beast tomorrow at work for sure. 
so yeah with that being said i will be linking down devo knives in the description so you guys are able to just check out what they have i think they have some pictures of possible future stuff going on I, I honestly haven't been on their website in a minute but regardless if you guys like this video go ahead and leave a like leave a comment if you guys have one of these on the way have one already if you were able to check out one of the pre-production uh i know a couple units were sent out scattered amongst knife enthusiasts to check out um yeah just let me know leave a comment let's chat so with that all being said, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. I know my day just got a whole lot better.